Hello there, welcome to the Web News with our pick of the stories making the online headlines. Coming up on today's show, Mexican web users imagine life post Peña Nieto. A teenage supermarket employee from the US becomes a web sensation. And a sea otter pup learning to swim. The past few weeks have seen Mexicans taking to the web, reaching out to their president, Enrique Peña Nieto, who's been in office since 2012, calling on him to step down. Under the Demando to Renuncia EPN hashtag, which translates as I demand your resignation EPN. They accuse him of being incapable of tackling the rampant violence across the country. And campaigning continues under the Si Renuncia Peña hashtag, meaning if Peña resigns. Abusers are imagining what Mexico could become once they've seen the back of the president. For a lot of social networkers, if Peña Nieto steps down, then Mexico will be able to make some important steps towards democracy. They're also saying that things certainly can't get any worse than they are at the moment, and life can only improve if the current head of state ends up resigning. The people who posted these messages to Twitter agree, saying there should be a national holiday and nationwide celebrations if Enrique Peña Nieto resigns. Some say the fiesta could continue for several days to mark the end of an era, the end of a presidency that's seen unprecedented public opposition. A simple tweet and a photo and a cash register employee for supermarket chain Target becomes a viral sensation in the United States. There's nothing extraordinary about the picture, but it's attracted a lot of attention from young women in particular. In just 24 hours, the young man, who, as we can see from his badge, is called Alex, has become the new darling of social media. Thousands have posted under the Alex from Target Twitter hashtag, complimenting the employee's good looks. As we can see here, some young ladies have even declared their undying love via comical photo montages. And Alex's explosive popularity even prompted a visit from well-known American TV personality Ellen DeGeneres. But some are wondering what the young man has actually done to deserve this sudden and unexpected rise to fame. Others are having a bit of fun suggesting rivals for Alex, like Mike from Publix or Kieran from T-Mobile or Steve from Starbucks. But it turns out this was actually a social media stunt. Startup Breaker has claimed responsibility, saying it posted the image online with Alex's agreement to demonstrate the power of the fan demographic on social networks, particularly as far as teenage girls are concerned. And if Alex's Twitter account is anything to go by, then mission accomplished. He now has over 650,000 followers. Tributes have been pouring onto social networks following the death of Manitas de Plata. The guitarist born Ricardo Belliardo passed away in Montpellier, France on November 5th, age 93. Web users have been paying their respects, hailing his musical genius and crediting him with popularizing flamenco music and bringing gypsy culture to audiences all over the world. Chartered obesity rates in the U.S. have increased by 500% since 1970. These and other alarming figures are illustrated on this infographic put together by ahealthblog.com. Other interesting stats show as fast food portion sizes have significantly grown over the past 50 years or so, while the number of kids that bike or walk to school has significantly dropped. And it's having a devastating impact. 43% of the U.S. population will be obese by 2018. <laughs> With Internet Archive, you can now play classic arcade games like Pac-Man, Cubit or Street Fighter 2 on any old computer, free of charge. The Internet Arcade now boasts 900 games and you don't have to install any additional software. You can run the games in your browser. The only drawback, there are bugs from time to time and some games have glitchy sound or no sound at all. Whoosh. 
In this video, currently doing the rounds online, we see a sea otter pup learning to swim. It was filmed by staff at the Shed Aquarium in Chicago, which has taken in the orphaned pup. A heartwarming and very cute clip. You can watch it all the way through on YouTube. Ha <laughs> ha. 